boom we are live ladies and gentlemen boys and girls welcome to the life is a chad youtube channel and i thank all of you for being here wherever you may be and of course however you may be listening i think the title of this video is going to be i can't believe i saw this <laughs> and of course what i cannot believe i saw but i really can it's just the corrupt bankrupt degenerate amoral society that we currently live in i was on youtube and i was just watching some clips and i saw on uh, that paramount plus has a show titled drag race something drag race something and i was like at first i thought it was like drag like like cars like a drag race or some shit <laughs> and then i go fuck there's like in the thumbnail there's like six people dressed in costumes on stage couldn't believe it and it's just crazy guys i i i really don't even know where we go from here in so many ways and this is why in my video yesterday uh on trump i said things are too far gone okay we, we don't need uh, 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 somebody who's going to get in and cut taxes. We need a revolutionary. We need somebody who's going to come along and change, completely overhaul the status quo. I, I, I mean, we really do. Because, you know, just complaining about this shit over and over and over again is ridiculous. And, you know, in a lot of regards, we brought this on ourselves. Because there was certain stuff that we, and I'm not saying you and me specifically, but society allowed to be the case. And we didn't think it was so bad because it was a little bit, it, it was not as bad as it is now. That's why they have the saying, you know, things happen and it didn't affect you, uh, so you decided to ignore it. Something happened, uh, uh, or this thing happened, you decided uh, to ignore it because it didn't affect you. It wasn't that bad. And then all of a sudden, it affects you, and it, it's too late. By the time it affects you, it's too late to change it. Wrong is wrong no matter what, whether it affects you or not. No matter what stage in the process it is, wrong is wrong. So... I'm trying to find, I'm sure I, if I just type in Paramount Plus, and it, you know, this is what counts as regular family, regular programming, family-oriented programming is drag race or drag, drag uh, modeling or, or drag show modeling. It's, it's, it's unreal. Drag Race all Ru RuPaul's Drag Race All Stars. That's what that's what it's called. This is the modern day, regular, regularly scheduled programming, and ultimately, what this all comes down to is again, the system wants all of these people to be fucked up like this because the more fucked up you are like this. To, to live this type of lifestyle, the more that you are away from reality and the more you are away from truth and an ability to fight against what is wrong. So that is why they want people like this totally gone from society, totally checked out mentally ill and and struggling in every sense of the word so that they have zero competition they can just proceed to implement the fucked up government that they want that will give them as much power as possible 
it's it stuns me to hear some conservatives who don't realize that it, it's it's so simple. I mean, it, these people who are elites of society, and I've said this in so many videos, they, I, I think the average citizen thinks that your average politician, your average elite of society really does deep down want what's best for you and me. They just want what's best for you and me. Are you kidding me? No, they don't want what's best for you and me. They want more power. They want more authority. They want more, more, more. And they will stop at nothing to get it. You know, it, it's it's like you see it in, in movies and you see it in dramas and stuff like that. And, and you, you, you don't think twice about it. But then in real life, you think that that that's not the case of course it is so anyways yeah i just wanted to do a quick video on that unbelievable this this is just yet another example of the messed up society that we have uh let me see if i can get it pulled up here what i am talking about just so sad so sad guys and I sadly, I I am positive that there are far more families that are watching this than you realize. This is it right here. What the fuck? It's uh it looks like it's like a reality TV show for uh drag people. Runway, oh my gosh. It's also very interesting how they essentially act as the status quo woman. But if you really think about it, isn't that what feminism was fighting against? That women have like a natural persona, a natural uh, essence about them. Yet when men pretend to be them, they literally act in all of the most extreme feminine feminine ways possible so anyways guys let me know what you guys think in the comment section Th shit is getting fucked up out here and uh we need all of you guys in this fight guys we need all of you guys we 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 got to start thinking bigger we have to start really coming up with something that can overhaul and make some significant changes because where we're at now, having small changes, uh, you know, not being taxed as much, uh, uh, cutting, uh, cutting spending and stuff like that. That that's like stuff that should be happening regardless, not something that's gonna fix the problem that has been building for years and years and years. All right, guys, like, comment, share, subscribe. And last but not least, DBAP, don't be a pussy well on facts or feelings because your feelings just don't matter. Love you, Kings. See you guys next time. Crisis King. Peace.